that is single cab ram bill ever on youtube I'm revealing one of the baddest, baddest single cab Ram build ever on YouTube. So let's get into it. First thing first, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday. It's the first day of the week. It's a blessing to be able to, you know, see the first day of the week, man. Definitely means a lot. You know, you got to gotta stay hungry stay humble man definitely gotta appreciate all the little things in life but long story short guys welcome back to my channel man i just want to be able to share with you guys one of my favorite single cat built on youtube ever pretty much um this is a hellcat swap dodge ram 1500 or hellcat ram whatever you want to call it one of the sickest build that i ever seen which is something that I never thought that is possible. I mean, anything is possible, but, you know, it's a little bit, you know, some complication and stuff like that, but it's not very common for you to see a single cab Ram 1500 with a Hellcat motor inside of it. Yes, it is made from Dodge, but it's pretty badass. I want to be able to give you guys my own personal opinion on that build. And I just want to be able to share some stuff that I find kind of interesting with you guys. But first thing first, definitely guys, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, subscribe to my channel, help your boy out. My goal is for me to hit 5,000 followers. I mean, subscribers, so I gotta hit that goal. But definitely, man, sub to the channel. You know, if it's your first time watching my videos and stuff, definitely I appreciate it. Even if it's not your first time, I appreciate it and stuff like that, man. Definitely means a lot to see some kind of progress and stuff with this whole YouTube journey. But first thing first, your boy about to head into the gym. So before I go into the gym, I just want to be able to share with you guys one of the sickest single cab brand built out there on YouTube. And it's from Boosted Motorsports. So that's the name, Boosted Motorsports. So first thing first, um, I want to be able to share some pictures with you guys so you guys could be able to see this bill. I'm pretty sure a lot of people didn't seen this before because it's not the first time. It's not the first time. This is something that's been done a couple years ago. So I'm a little bit kind of late catching up on it. But like I say, you know, I'm a, I'm a Dodge Ram guy. I own a um, crew cab. So to see a single cab with a Hellcat engine inside of it, that's definitely out of this world and it's something completely different. So the first thing I want to jump into is, honestly, I never really, I'm just giving you guys my own personal opinion once again, because I like I like to clarify stuff like this before I get into, you know, putting, you know, being able to, ex, ex, well, <laughs> <laughs> being able to pretty much express myself and tell you guys how I feel about this. The reason why I feel like this build, one of the baddest build out there is because number one is, um, this is something that you don't see too often to be able to see a single cab Dodge Ram 
normally it's like a you know it's like a it's like the scat packs you know the same motor that's in the scat packs and stuff like that normally those are like what you will probably comp you will probably most likely see in a single cap or you'll probably see something else but to see a hellcat motor that's inside of a single cap dodge ram i know for a fact i'm not no expert no mechanic or anything like that but just to be able to see that that's like mind blowing to be able to see something like that and the fact is i don't know pers me personally from ex people you know from seeing different kind of people you know doing some research and stuff like that a lot of people think that doing that doing a hellcat swap into a dodge ram 1500 or doing it pretty much is very very complicated so the reason why one of my reason why i want to share this make a video about this truck is because to me number one is is a badass build and it's something that's completely unique and man is i love seeing stuff like that i love seeing stuff like that to see stuff like that just you know make me get me excited and it make my blood rush and stuff but honestly me personally i would love to do something like that but i just feel like it would just be it just, it's just it would just be too much it would just be too much but you guys so i'm just gonna share a couple i'm just gonna be able to share a couple of the stuff that that was done to this truck i don't know how much i don't know if he have it tuned or i don't even know if i'm pretty sure he got it tuned but i i don't know how much power it makes but i'm just making this this take this upload as a kind of like a i don't know the perfect word to say but kind of like a you know to be able to showcase this truck and just to be able to give my own personal opinion i wouldn't really say it's like a review or anything like that but honestly like one of the things that i want to talk about to do something like that i feel like so doing something like that will cost pretty much a lot of money to do and it wouldn't be something that's cheap to do and then also number two is i'm not a mechanic and i feel like if you you know if you know about cars you're a mechanic well if you like a mechanic and stuff like that that's like a project that would be pretty much good for you to do instead of you know you trying to find somebody like you know somebody like me i'm not a mechanic but i'm still learning some stuff to be able to find like a shop to do something like that is going to cost a lot of money for you to do compared to you knowing what you're doing and doing it yourself and i want to give a huge props to boost boost it motorsports and um just to be able to like see something like that is like mind-blowing to me man it's like definitely mind-blowing to me but here i go i'm about to show you guys a couple clips of this hellcat ram or hellcat dodge ram 1500 or whatever you guys want to call it but i think this is one of the baddest build out there but i'm looking around because i'm sitting in the parking lot right now and i'm just recording some this before i go into the gym but just to be able to see something that's this sick but well, check it out, here's a few clips. so one of the things too that i've seen that was in this clip that i show you guys is to see to be able to do something like that honestly it seemed like it's gonna be like a nightmare if can you imagine you know doing something like that yourself mm -hmm. 